on from the last video on the booster where we basically did uh, the fuel pump and obviously the air box and checked all the spark plugs. Uh, just a quick one this week. Um, it's actually something I didn't even realise. Um, you can actually check the health of your bike with a wire. Uh, stay with me, I haven't lost the plot. I'll show you how. Right, so basically all I need, obviously I've put the battery back in, I need this piece of wire. Because unbeknown to me until the other day, up underneath here, if you can see it, I've moved some of the bodywork out of the way, is a plug with a rubber cap on the top. This is the plug that dealers use basically to plug your bike in to find out what's wrong with it. So basically a diagnostic plug. Um, but as I say, it is tucked normally way under here. As I say, I mean some bikes, um, this should be similar on most Suzuki's. It might be a bigger plug. Um, as I say, this is a four way, but it's actually only got two terminals. I'll zoom in there for you. You can see one there and one there. So basically, with a piece of wire, plug one into one terminal. Actually, the wire might be a bit thick. One into one terminal, and then loop it over. As you can see there, one into the other terminal. Right. As for the rest of it, make sure your kill switch is off. So basically, you turn on your ignition as usual. Everything lights up. Hopefully you can see that there. It comes up with check. And literally and there you go. That's actually changed to C00, which is a good sign, which means there are no defects with the bike and everything is okay. Um, I'll actually put a list of all the C codes in the description below. But it is a way you can actually work out what is wrong and you can basically go through the list and find out rather than actually taking it to a dealer paying extortionate amounts of money for them to plug it in for you charge you however much and then say this is wrong with it that's wrong with it this way you can actually do it yourself so clever little system and that's all done just by literally having the battery in and using that so as I say, just a quick one this week, that was quite a useful one, um, I actually picked that up the other day, so I thought I'd let people know about it, so anybody with boosters that's got that, you can basically find out what the problem is with your bike, so as I say, list in the description below, um, please remember to like and subscribe, there is a subscribe button now on all my videos, uh, in the bottom right hand corner, so um, join me again next time, thanks for watching, cheers, bye.